hometown, Sonoma County. We just got back from Tahoe. Michael's actually in Nashville right now. Saying goodbye to him and watching him like take a flight as I drive home was probably just the hardest thing ever. I hate saying goodbye to people that I love. So I'm currently in Sonoma County just with my family. I'm gonna spend some time here. I have my cousin's bridal shower next Saturday. So I'm just gonna spend the week here rather than flying back and forth. My friend Sophie is also coming out here to visit me and I'm gonna show her around. I'm so excited because Sonoma County is just so beautiful. So we're gonna do a bunch of fun things like maybe go kayaking, paddle boarding, hiking, all the things. But right now I'm about to go to the grocery store with my dad and his girlfriend and we're gonna pick up some food for the week. <laughs> back from the grocery store and I picked up a lunch. I actually haven't eaten anything yet. Um, I feel like the medication that I'm on kind of makes me forget about food and then all of a sudden I get like anxiety and I get shaky and I like have to have it. So we last minute stopped at one of my favorite restaurants here and I got this like avocado taco salad. It has shredded chicken, avocado, cucumber, lettuce, tomatoes and then this like lime um, dressing it's really good so that's what I'm eating dad is looking through all of these old pictures you want to show him some oh no another one oh, yeah. cousin. look at my little brother oh my gosh he's just so cute that's, that's a different one yeah, that can really show you how big he is. Thank you. Grandma. Who is this? <laughs> you and Grandma. Aww. That was a fun day. Yeah, that was a fun day. So I just got back from a dance show. My dad's girlfriend's daughter had a show. And she had like a ton of routines. My favorite ones were the ballet. I think it's so cute. I totally want to see if my future daughter would want to do ballet because i just think it's so cute um but anyways we ate at a mexican restaurant i got enchiladas of corn tortillas which was pretty good um now i'm probably just gonna shower get ready for bed you know before i get ready for bed i do want to talk about the topic of having divorced parents because i know it's really really common these days and to be honest it never affected me until like maybe about a year ago and I feel like it's kind of like when I've had this whole like you know lifestyle switch and all of that and like you know just thinking about building a family with Michael and having that of my own and just how important the family unit is and I feel like I'm like now feeling the full effects of having a broken family and I know a lot of people go through this and so if you are too I just want you to know you're not alone and I really wish there was more advice I could give you on this topic but to be honest I'm kind of just figuring it out too and one thing that I will say I feel like for a long time I held a lot of like resentment and bitterness maybe towards my parents and not necessarily because they divorced but because of past issues that I had with them and I really had to learn how to forgive before our relationships could really go anywhere and something that really has helped me forgive is praying to God I have literally prayed to God to you know even just like show me what they've been through in their life to give me more empathy so I can forgive them some more understanding to know why they are the way they are and you know it, it it's definitely a constant battle of praying each time you start to feel a little bit of resentment or bitterness towards them again 
Um, and I truly, like, this is probably the first trip home that I feel like I've really been able to let go of the past and treat this as, like, almost like a new relationship in a way and try to wipe the slate clean and to be honest, it's it's been really, really nice and I know that a lot of people struggle with this. So, just want you to know you're not alone. It's hard. And pray, truly. I really feel like God will reveal things to you and he'll help you through times like this and I really owe all of the forgiveness I've been able to give to anybody, to God. And yeah, so anyways, I'm gonna get ready for bed. I think we're gonna watch a movie, Into the Wild or The Wild or something like that. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get ready and I'll see you tomorrow. Hello guys, I'm on my way to go pick up Sophie from the airport. She had just landed. I think we might go and get some food after. I'm kind of hungry. I'm not really sure what we're gonna do today. She might be tired, so I didn't want to like plan anything too crazy. We might try and make a protein ice cream. Sophie came to Nashville a couple weeks ago, and so I'm so happy that I get to see her again because usually I only get to see her like a couple times a year, and it's so sad because we get along so well. Like we like all of the same things. Um, and yeah, so I'm so excited to see her. We're gonna have so much fun. I'm gonna show her around my hometown. <laughs> so if you just got here, hello. We're at my favorite Mexican restaurant. Whoa. Whoa. to go on a hike. I'm gonna take her to this place I used to go all the time when I was younger. It's so pretty. Daisy always has the best walks, I feel like. Really? Yeah. Thanks. In Nashville too. She took me on so many little forest walks and adventures. It's really like my favorite thing to do. I like go on all trails and I save all of these different parks and Ooh. yeah, that's yeah, my biggest that. tip. Anyways, we're gonna go walk. <laughs> about to go do? We're going to the farmer's market downtown Windsor. And then? And then we're gonna go cruise <laughs> the Hillsburg Square. Square. <laughs> and then we're gonna go to grandma's house, play some glow in the dark bocce ball. Take advantage of my day. <laughs> We're trying some honey. This is blue honey and it's colored with spirulina, so it's good for detoxing. So hopefully this helps your moldy girl. Mm. Ooh, wow. Wait, oh, yeah, that's so good. It's the afternoon. Sophie and I, we worked out this morning and we got ready. Today was a hair wash day. We both did so, our hair. <laughs> yes, I feel so much better. We are about to get matcha and then go to the Redwood. <gasps> I forgot we were getting matcha. Yes.
Sophie and I just got to one of my favorite restaurants here. It's called the Farmhouse in and Stay. The whole vibe of this place is just so like, I don't know, it's just so like sweet and like wildflowery, like all the plants that they have. I really feel like if I were to have a restaurant or like hotel, it would totally be something like this. I'm such a bad influence, you guys. Just kidding, guys. It's my decision. I've been eating kind of bad. <laughs> we had like those Ritter Sport cornflake chocolate. chocolate. It was so good. And we're like, oh yeah, we'll just have like a square. We had a <laughs> like, whole freaking <laughs> like five. <laughs> Literally five squares. Um, but anyways, we just got back from dinner. And no, actually, we didn't just get back. We're still at the we're place. Got, we're back in the car. Um, we're driving back to my dad's house, and then we're probably just gonna get ready for bed. I really wanna watch Sophie's vlog. just ordered some friendship necklaces oh it says wait earliest estimated delivery at june 20th that's the day before i leave the ship we're getting our necklaces we're so excited we almost didn't order it to my dad's house because we didn't know if we'd get here in time however urgent shipping was free so that means i'll get here in two to three days and sophie leaves in four days this thing better arrive or i'm I'm calling credit card fraud. <laughs> I'm so excited. We both individually have been wanting this necklace, but in like different colors. I ordered I got it. it. I got it. That's how I we got it. Too. I wanted to throw <laughs> up. <laughs> Good morning. Morning. We are about to meet my mom. A fit check. Okay. Take it away. My top, Durf Avenue. Pants, Brandy Melville. You can kind of tell they're like boot cut. And then I have these dark brown Converse on. And then this bag from Osoy. Rings are these little white gold hoops. They're like these like thick hoops. I actually got them at the Melrose Trading Post like years ago one of those little stands and then this little oval diamond is actually from michael he got it off of a vintage seller on ebay um this top is from reformation my skirt i i don't know how you say it, thrifted from depop i feel like it's kind yeah. of like thrifting and then i have on my sambas Cute. and that is the fit what are your earrings my earrings are from are just little diamonds that match my necklace. These are Austin got me these, my boyfriend, as a gift for my birthday a couple years ago. And then this necklace is from Cartier. This is my mother. When was the last time you were on the vlog, mom? I think a while ago. Maybe, yeah. what, LA or Nashville? Maybe. We're about to go in and grab a matcha. Sophie and I are really tired because we stayed up super late. We were just like editing our vlogs and posting on Snapchat. We need caffeine. Yeah, so we're gonna go do that and then we're gonna go to this little like beach town called Inverness. Inverness. We just 
stopped to get a little snack. We were kind of feeling a little bit ill from the matcha because I feel like it was just so much caffeine all at once. Like they, I think they did like a tablespoon or something. And usually I'm used to like a half a teaspoon. And so I started to feel a little bit shaky and like nauseous. So I got this chia seed pudding and then a Mountain Valley water. back in the car and my hair was super super tangly from the wind and so I just wanted to say this as a reminder get this little mini wet brush it literally fits in your purse it's so small and it's so handy and I feel like it just helps me refresh my look Sophie and I just got ready to go to Safari West, but before we do, we're gonna open up our friendship necklaces. They're so, so cute! cute. We're about to get on our big truck and go and see all of the animals. We're so excited. I cannot wait to go see everything. The wind she wants to get on. Sophie and I are getting ready to go on the lake with my dad and his girlfriend. I think we're gonna do some paddle boarding. So before I go, I'm gonna open up some of these packages. I need to film some ads while I'm out on the lake. about to go and get some smoothies and then we're gonna go on a little adventure slash road trip with my dad we're gonna go out to Sausalito and mm -hmm. just go drive around through all the cute towns around here I'm so excited I'm so sad it's my last day I know I miss you when you leave I know I'm, like, I actually miss you too I'm home and I'm like oh like I already miss you <laughs> I my heart like, I, I feel the same way that's how I felt in Nashville yeah like when you left and I went and sat on the couch but and like edited by myself I like looked to the side and I was like where is she <laughs> um anyways it's a sad day but it's okay we'll plan another trip soon yeah um we're gonna go and get some smoothies right now and then go along with our day toodles bye makeup hits like we're six hours deep it's like it has the expiration date yeah like, it's make i don't know if the makeup spray yeah same with my hair i don't know same <sighs> saying goodbye i'm so sad i'm sad too i don't think i'm gonna cry hey i'm gonna cry stop stop, stop. okay <laughs> anyways 
<laughs> You're really gonna make me cry. Say bye, vlog. Ciao. Bye. <laughs> I will. <laughs> okay, bye.